Uh, okay, so if you want to make a resume or just edit one, there's. Uh, I mean, first of all, let's just let's just look for a resume template, assuming you don't already have one. Uh, yeah, just search for one, select the one you like, uh, click on it, uh, click on customize, double click on the text and start editing things. Uh, e editing things, I guess. Um, yeah, if you want to move things, you just move them. If you want to delete things, you just click on the layer and click delete. If you want to change colors, click on color. Uh, yeah, if you want to replace the image or uploads, add your own image, upload your own image and then just uh, drop your image into like on top of the existing image uh yeah and like once you're done go to share download pdf standard and um, download your uh, your resume basically so this is the first way to do it uh the second way we're gonna assume you already have a template a, a, a resume in pdf file format i guess uh and you want to edit it uh just simply drag and drop it in canva in the upload section or just click on upload and then upload my own files and that's it uh, yeah and just click on it it should get opened now the thing is uh, so PDF files are recognized and uh, uh, they, they will be get opened and stuff like that but as you can see they're not properly aligned they're not formatted properly so uh, you will have to basically play around with settings uh, redo the the template you have the text right but you have to like create uh, for example this is not a list this is not one either you'll have to like recreate it like I just did uh, delete the points align it properly uh, yeah for some reason this one is is, is in three rows you'll have to like uh, just make it one row uh, move things around the line them again yeah so this is the process basically if things get broken when you're importing the PDF file now normally it shouldn't break if it's made properly but sometimes it does like it just did now so uh, yeah just move around mo move the, the stuff around and yeah once it's aligned properly you can just double click and start editing like you did with the previous template uh yeah and once it's it's you're done editing again you go to download pdf standard and that's it uh, but the good thing is once you imported it in canva and, and formatted to to use it uh it will get saved automatically so you will be able to make further changes and stuff like that if you ever want to adjust your resume it will continue to be on your canva account so you can just uh, yeah, add new stuff, add new experience, I don't know, job, previous jobs and stuff like that. And just download it again without having to do the whole thing all over. Uh, but yeah, like I said, normally you shouldn't have like things getting misaligned and stuff like that. But sometimes it happens. And probably Canva will continue to like improve this thing so that uh, it gets important like better. But at this point, sometimes it just doesn't so uh yeah but this is the process of fixing it just uh just play around with the settings and uh uh split them into individual layers right you just copy the thing and then just uh you have the first section uh remove all the empty rows uh yeah now you have the second section and, and stuff like that so you just uh yeah there's a c somewhere what that's missing now yeah, uh, but anyway, so that's that's the process and that's how you do. That's how you edit resume or just start from a pre-made template and edit it. So, yeah.